Well, I've got some good news and I've got some bad news. I guess I'll let you guys in on the bad news first. I had a, a whole bunch of footage that I have unfortunately lost, including the remainder of this year's uh, bed fishing uh, series. I don't know how it happened. I went and tried to access my hard drive the other day and it just, everything was gone it seemed. It didn't even wanna show any sort of files. So I don't know, I'm looking to get that fixed, but I'm not sure that's gonna happen. But anyway, so that's the bad news. All these videos that I've had saved up for you guys, including, like I said, the rest of this year's bed fishing series is unfortunately gone for the moment as far as as far as I can tell. So anyway, the good news is I've, uh, I've finally got my giveaway all together. I've got my t-shirts made that I was waiting for. The giveaway is gonna include one of these t-shirts that I've got on right now. It's a t-shirt that I got made for my channel. I got a bunch of these made up, so that'll be included in the giveaway, along with a pretty good little uh, tackle assortment I've got going. I've been saving it up for a while now in anticipation for this giveaway, so. Thank you guys for over 1,500 subscribers. That's a, that's a pretty good number. I'm definitely trying to get higher though. So uh, anyway, the way that you enter this uh, giveaway, all you gotta do is you just gotta be subscribed to my channel, obviously. And then you just have to like and comment on this video right here, and that'll get you entered. So uh, I'll do a random draw of everybody that entered, and then I'll uh, get that prize out to, them, out to you guys uh, whenever I draw for that. But anyway, uh, so, in lieu of not having any footage really to show you anymore, I've got to go get all new footage. So I'm out here at a pond that I've been fishing lately at night actually with my brothers. And uh, we've been catching them pretty good uh, with a full moon. And the cooler nights obviously during the summer are usually a good little feeding time too. So the cooler weather along with those that full moon has been a really good deal lately. But anyway, I'm out here this evening, obviously not at night now, but I'm out here this evening to see if I can try to get on that same bite. I've had a, quite, a bit, quite a bit of success on a topwater, a buzz bait actually. Uh, just a bait that makes a lot of noise on top of the water. And like I said, with that full moon, they're looking up to feed. So I'm out here, uh, like I said, this evening trying to get on that same success. I'm gonna start out with a topwater, not with a buzz bait. I'm actually gonna start out with a little popper first, but uh, might switch over to that buzz bait or I might switch over to something else depending on what happens here. But anyway, all right, let's see if we can get on here. Hmm. Quite a few little perch and minnows and stuff up in here by this concrete, but don't see any bass up in here at all. Haven't scared any or anything. Definitely scaring a bunch of minnows though. Golly, they're all up in here. Yeah, there goes a bigger perch right out there. Man, it's really weird though. For some reason in this pond, I almost never get bit over here on this side. Gotten bit a couple times, but haven't really been that big of a fish. All my bigger fish have come along that side. I'm actually gonna make my way back around that way right now because the sun is gonna make for terrible viewing if I've got it in front of me instead of behind me. So I'm gonna go back around this way so I got the sun behind me so you guys can see better. I'm gonna hopefully get blown up on this thing. Golly, there's tons of freaking bait fish up here shallow. There should be some bass up here blasting them this evening. Ooh. <laughs> we should have hit the water. Oh no! Dang it! He came off. Golly! Ah, yeah, yeah. Don't know what happened there. As soon as it hit the water, fish latched onto it. Didn't blow it up very big at all. But I definitely know I had a bite. Set the hook into him. And he stuck pretty hard, and then he just jumped and came off. Dang it! Must have had him hooked in a bad spot. Oh, golly. 
Just scared another fish from the shallows right there. Golly, that was not a bad fish that I lost though, dang it. Wasn't a real big one, but it wasn't a bad one either. Golly. Just scared a fish right there for sure. Sent a bunch of bait flying too, dang it. Oh, wait, what the heck? Did I have a bite right there? I need to start paying attention to what's going on around me. I think I might have had a bite right there. Can't tell, it just got heavy. I might have just hung up some grass for a second, but I don't know. I wasn't looking, I was looking at the fish that I scared over here, dang it. Just scared another fish from way up shallow, but I don't know why. Didn't eat my bait. I threw a cast right up in there before I walked up over here. Scared this fish out towards the middle though. I don't know, I guess it could be a turtle too. See some turtle heads popping up out there. I don't know though. It sure was moving like it was a bass. This is, it's weird. Oops. Something behind it. <laughs> Not sure what that was. Fish came up and hit it from the side. I jerked too fast on that one for sure. I was trying to hurry up and get it around the grass actually. There was a little gra grass clump over there. I was trying not to get my bait hung up in. Golly. Dang it, that's two bites now that I wasn't able to land. Ah, yeah, yeah. That one didn't look like a bad fish either. Golly. I. I went to hurry up and try to get around that grass. And when the fish hit, I didn't slow myself down. I just kept my momentum going and tried to set the hook from there. It was a bad idea. Yeah, see there used to be water all the way up here, right where I'm standing, there used to even be some water. All the way up to this bank right here. So there's a lot more water covering this grass before. There would always be a fish right up here in this corner. Might be a little bit too shallow now though. There would actually always be a fish way up in here, not even that corner right there. They'd push past the grass. I'd usually catch one up in here actually. Gosh, where'd this guy come from? What are you doing holding this dog? Goodness gracious, what are you doing man? Ruining my fishing is what he's doing. I say ruining my fishing. Like I said, that side is actually where I normally don't get bit pretty much at all for whatever reason. Pretty much all my bites have come along this side. Like you just saw, I got two bites right there. I'm actually going to switch over to something here real quick though. Bait that I don't really throw a lot at all. Bait that I should probably throw more often, but just don't have a lot of confidence and a lot of experience with it. I'm gonna throw me a swim jig. Just a, a white swim jig. White with a little bit of chartreuse. A little bit of purple on it. Just a little shad color there. All right, I've got my little swim jig tied on here. Now I gotta decide if I wanna keep walking around going towards this guy, or if I wanna turn around, go back where I just fished over. Like I said, that's actually the better part of the pond, so it's kind of where I want to be fishing, but I wanted to give it a little bit of a break first. This guy's kind of over here right in front of me though, making me not want to keep walking this way. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and turn around actually. Just go back down the area that I know is a good spot before it gets dark.
Ooh. Something just scared a bunch of shad right here. I don't know if it was when my bait came by or what, but I don't think it was my bait coming by that scared them. I think a bass probably came to look at my bait because it was about five feet next to my bait with a shad sprayed away. Oh, well, I don't know. There they go again when I cast over there. Right in the same exact spot. a bass up in there just now little guy <laughs> well looks like they're starting to get shallow oh shoot golly I wasn't looking, I was distracted by these people over here. Just scared a fish from super shallow right there. It looked like a good fish too, dang it. Probably would have scared the fish anyway, actually. I mean, don't think it's because I was looking off. But, wow, that's crazy. Ooh, golly, that was a fish. Just barely bumped it and then it was gone. Saw a little swirl too. Probably just ate the tail. Dang it. Come on, fish. Oh.